Channel 3 Early Warning Weather. Downright hot across parts of Connecticut today. The last time the Hartford area saw 90 degrees was back on August 30th. And we did make it to 90 officially in the Hartford area. 90 at Windsor Locks and at Hartford Brainerd. Sitting at 86 right now in Putnam. 85 in Waterbury. 89 in Meriden. Along the shoreline with more of an onshore component. Temperatures are running a bit lower but still well above average for this time of year. When it comes to 90 degree days in April, we've had them before. And the most recent uh, 90 degree day in April was back in 20. 2012, the earliest on record since 1905. It happened three times, all on April 7th, 1929, 1991, and 2010. The average first 90 degree day for the Hartford area, though, usually is not until May 30th. So we are running about six weeks ahead of when we would typically see that. But this is the type of pattern where we tend to see impressive warmth. We've got high pressure off the East Coast. Southwest winds pulling in a lot of warmth for us, and the warm front at this point well to our north. We'll keep an eye on these fronts as we get into the weekend. Uh, notice the difference between us and parts of Maine on the cooler side of that front. Closer to 70 degrees in Bangor, Maine, 63 in Portland, 74 in Boston now as the sea breeze has picked up. But there's a lot of heat away from the shoreline. 86 in Scranton, 88 in Albany, sitting at 86 in Philly right now as well. A time lapse on our ICAM here at Powder Ridge in Middlefield shows that we began the day with full sunshine and we don't have leaves on the trees this time of year, so we can really efficiently heat things up. Uh, temperatures climbed very quickly this morning, and of course, many of us ended up here. Our network of neighborhood weather stations still reporting temperatures. Temperatures close to 90 degrees. Berlin, Willington at 89 right now. Meriden at 87. Uh, Litchfield at 85. A live look in our ICAM over Hartford shows the blue skies have persisted in the distance. A bit of haze and very similar on our ICAM here in New Haven. The sleeping giant there in the background. 81 degrees. Wind out of the south southwest. It's that southerly component to the wind at the shoreline, which has kept things just a bit cooler. Futurecast shows that tonight we stay on the clear side. Some high clouds start to build in tomorrow, but even with those high clouds around, we're still expecting record warmth warmth for the day. By Saturday, though, we start to track some showers. Showers have trended a bit later. It's more likely that we see showers develop later on Saturday, uh, possibly lasting into Sunday morning. So don't expect much relief when it comes to pollen. Pollen counts remain high through the day on Saturday, and then things should fall back a bit on Sunday. By Monday, we track this cold front, which is also trended a bit later. That's expected to move through uh, Monday, bringing our next round of more appreciable rain. Tonight, temperatures between about 55 and 60 degrees. Clear, Light calm winds uh, is certainly going to be another hot one tomorrow with temperatures for most inland at or slightly above 90 degrees at the shoreline right around 80 degrees. The records for tomorrow for the Hartford area, 82, Bridgeport, 73. We're forecasting 93 for the Hartford area, 82 uh, for Bridgeport. So expecting to beat both records by about 10 degrees. Inland areas on Saturday, 74. So certainly cooler, but still above average for this time of year. 67 at the shoreline on Saturday. Showers lingering into Sunday. Monday looks to be cloudier with some showers around a bit breezy at times. However, the warming trend returns next week and there's a chance we could be back near 70 by Thursday.